The dumbest game show answers. Budapest is the capital of what European country? I thought Europe was a country. All right, my friends. However, if we can't answer the question correctly, the answer isn't dumb. How many can we get? Autosomal dominant compelling heliophthalmic outburst syndrome, whose initials offer a clue, is the need to do what a choose. A chew, oh, sneezing, sneezing, sneezing. Oh my God, is that where a chew comes? No, a chew comes from because it sounds like a chew, right? Just by looking at it, I can't say that Come the on, answer is just on. jumping out at me. I'm it so literally so says, dumb. read the first letter of every word. I, I see now. Okay, a chew, there we go. So let's go D, final answer. Oh, excuse me, excuse me, C, C. C, C. Oh, you idiot. You said final answer, you moron. However, that's not really that stupid. It was just, uh, I know I've just called the man a moron, but it was just like a brain fart, right? He didn't actually think you, uh, you say a chew when you hiccup. And he got a grand, right? Name something you might get in trouble for doing at a nude beach. Uh, um, taking pictures of people's areolas. Uh, streaking, going nude. Huh? No, that's the one place you won't get in trouble for that. I'm gonna read the question again. I want you to say the exact same answer you said. Mm -hmm. All right? Name something you might get in trouble for doing at a nude beach. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, I missed that one word. I missed that word right there. Uh-uh. I missed that word right there. He's burning. He's burning. How many decades... What well, year is this from? ...his mother has lived. How many decades has your mom lived, did they say? How many decades will your husband say his mother has lived? Gloria. Ten decades. Ten decades. <laughs> Gentlemen, how many decades has your mother lived? Daryl, you have a troubled look on your face. What's the matter? Oh, I don't know what a decade is. <laughs> Ten decades. Ten decades. <laughs> Was that good? Are they both right? Or are they both dumb and they just know each other well? Name another way people say mother. How about Nana? If you're like a bit of a millennial with shit crack, you would say birth giver. What about Steve Nene? Nene? <laughs> she said, ooh, watch me. Give a stupid answer. She, didn't you say Nana? I did say and that, I said Steve, yes. Nana. Uh huh. And I said Nana. It's the same thing, Sheila. You silly tart. In computer security, what word can go before code, phrase, and word? Code, phrase, and word. Pass code, pass phrase, password? Pass. Correct. In what play by oh. Shakespeare? <laughs> That's good. Oh, there he is. You've been good. You pissed on the rug? Most definitely. Tell him in. A. Wrong. <laughs> I've never had this happen. It's the first time. Chris? I know it. You know it? All right. Fill it in. Oh. Yes. I. Yes. T. Yes. E. Yes. Uh. <laughs> yeah, but the, no, but the host was fooled too. This wasn't dumb enough to make it through for 50 years and still be in the archives for stupid game show answers. Really? Is everybody on this show a moron? So I sorry, I talked over it. Name something that's hard to do with your eyes open. Read. <laughs> that's pretty good. Oh wait, open. Oh shit. Oh, uh, it's not dumb. Yeah, read. Uh huh. In the 2017 World Athletics Championships, the mm -hmm. men's 10,000 meters was won by the British runner Mo Who. Farrah. Mo. Bamba. Mo. 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 Eh? Mo, Mo, Mo. Mo Farrah. Mo Farrah, yeah. It's no. no good you saying yes once I've given you the answer. <laughs> Name something specific of Leonardo DiCaprio's that you like to hold. Wood. The Mona uh, Lisa is painting. Haha, oh. <laughs> 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 JR, oh, that's Da Vinci, not DiCaprio. Uh, his 24 year old uh, spouses. <laughs> um, his 23 year old spouses. <laughs> On a magnetic compass, which direction is directly opposite to east? North. How we? Name an animal with three letters in its name. Cow. Frog. Name an animal with three letters in its name. Alligator. <laughs> ah! We surveyed 100 people and asked them to name a way of toasting someone. Uh, raising a glass. Michelle. Over a fire. Oh! <laughs>
It's not over fire. A grill's a hot plate. Give me a boy's name that starts with the letter H. Jose. <laughs> oh, Roger. How did it take Roger a minute and he still didn't get it? Something people take with them to the beach. Turkey? The, f <laughs> the first thing you buy in a supermarket. Uh, turkey. <laughs> a food often stuffed. Turkey. <laughs> Name something you might accidentally leave on all night. You're not going to leave the lamp on accidentally. Uh, the oven. Your shoes. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Although you're just not going to do it, are you? You're a bit tired, are you? Oh, long day. Long day. Put you back in your bed. I. H. Wish. Fish love. Sish. Bish. Mish. Nish. Tish. Wish. Sish. Wish list. Ah, uh, it's, it's not a physical thing. People to name something that comes in sevens. Uh, triplet. No. Caroline. Fingers. <laughs> what does come? Septuplets? Septup. Name a country. Yeah. A man with a mustache should visit to meet a woman with a mustache. France. Yeah. Paris. <laughs> the French women don't have mustaches. Tell me what type of vehicles are used to compete in the legendary Tour de France. Alan again. Bikes. Uh, uh, SUVs. In literature, Published in the year 2000, oh, year again. the fourth mm -hmm. installment of the series of books by J.K. Rowling about a boy a wizard is entitled Harry Potter and the Goblet of what? I've never watched that. I've never watched Harry Potter. Goblet of... Wine. Oh, I don't know. Pass. What? Fire. Goblet of witches. Name something you feel before you buy it. Feel before you buy it. A haircut? Mike! Excited. <laughs> well, yeah, if you find something good. I like it. That's not dumb. Name something normally worn only by children. Diapers. Clothes. <laughs> this term for a long-handled gardening tool can also mean an immoral pleasure seeker. Ken. What's a hoe? No. <laughs> ah! They teach you that in school in Utah, huh? Al, what's a rake? A rake is right. No, it's a hoe. He was right. Toya, 100 men, tell me a traffic sign that best describes your love life. Do not pass go. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, that's Monopoly, you donkey. Name a number that most men exaggerate. 100. No, no, no. It's what the number means, Jenna. 69? Good one, Ashlyn. Name a yellow fruit. Orange. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 yes. Okay, hang on, hang on. Right, let, let's watch his whole thing. I will prove my superior intelligence right now. What term is used in English speaking countries to indicate a score of zero in a tennis match? Nil. Um, love. Oh! Yes, in a Shit. In a traditional nursery rhyme, what are the names of the pair who went up the hill Jack and to Jill. fetch a pail of water? Jack and Jill? Yes. <laughs> what four-letter prefix from a Greek word meaning great is added to words such as hertz and ton to indicate a quantity of one million of such units? Hertz and ton. Uh, uh, gigaton. Ache. No, mega. Fuck! Brookside, which ran for more than 20 years, was set in which city in northwest England? Liverpool. Yes. Shit! 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 All right, hang on, hang on, hang on. Right, lads, it's fine. I, I don't know what the score is, but I, I, need, I need it. Okay. The former White House intern Monica Lewinsky was involved in a political uh, Bill scandal Clinton. in 1998 following revelations about her relationship with which US president? Bill Clinton? Yes. You chummy hobbit! Montego Bay, Ocho Rios and Negril are popular tourist destinations on which Caribbean island? St. Lucia. Um, pass. What variety of green tea is named for the fact that it's made from leaves rolled into small pellets that resemble an explosive substance? Censure. No. Explosive, explosive, match up. No, gunpowder tea, ladies' uh -huh. night celebration, and get down on it. With UK hit singles for which American funk and soul band nah. formed in, no way he gets in the 1960s. Pass. Which day of the week is known in German as Sonntag? Sunday. Monday. 
No, Sunday. Ah! In the name of the London-based orchestra, often known as the LPO, the letter P stands for what word? Percussion. Protection. Philharmonic. What Fuck. word modelled on the term gazump means to reduce the amount of a previously agreed offer on a property just before... Hang on, hang on. I don't understand the question, but I know what this is. What word modelled on the term gazump means to reduce the amount of a previously agreed offer on a property just before the exchange of contracts? Pass. Spirit of Heart's Horn is an archaic name for an aqueous solution of which gas that was once obtained from the distillation of the antlers of deer. Oh, it's good. Uh, ammonia. Hydrogen. No, ammonia. No. I think that's, I, knew, I only knew that because I've seen this before. Well, no, I've not seen the whole thing before, but I've seen that clip before. Oh my God, I, I prepared him for this five years ago. All right, anyway, uh, good shift for me. I'm de I definitely beat him. Uh, okay, back to it. Oh. Pointless, just like that general knowledge round for Chris. Should we go for D? Yeah, no, actually E, E. E. Justin Bieber. What? what? We have no idea who any of them are. No, what about- Oh God, I know them all. E, Justin Bieber. <laughs> okay, let's see how many of our 100 said that. You're just wrong. In his epic poems, Homer often refers to nectar as the drink of the gods and which other substance as their food. I know we like donuts. Oh no, not that type of home. I like the philosopher. Donuts, please, Ben. Okay. Oh no, fella. Could have bought a hair transplant with the money. I uh, sorry, we're not wanting to talk. I like to cover mine up. <laughs> ben Shepard's got a nice tan mind, doesn't he? One hundred people, one hundred seconds. To name as many countries that end with two countries that ends with two consonants, consonant, not uh German Germany. Why is a consonant, right? Paris. Oh, we've seen this before. My oh, friend's pissed with that. We've been making reaction videos too long. No. If Santa Claus was sick on Christmas Eve, who might he ask to deliver the presents for the win? The elves. Okay, I'm thinking outside the box. He already knows the route. It's... Easter Bunny. Yeah, yeah, that's right. How does Easter Bunny know the, the route? They are definitely married and related. But no one is too small to make a difference is a collection of speeches made by a Swedish climate change activist. What's her name? Greta. Sharon. Greta Thunberg. Greta Thunberg! What date is Christmas Day traditionally celebrated each year? 25th of December. Wednesday. It's December the 25th. Oh. Wednesday. Okay. So what are they? Eh? Uh, right. So this is like, I'm assuming you've got to look at the picture and it's like a popular saying. Pirate DVDs. Jimmy! Pirate, Pirate videos. Pirate DVDs? I mean... <laughs> Well, we have to take your first answer, Jimmy. <laughs> That's not that dumb. Ellie! Pirate CDs! <laughs> <laughs> Faye! Pirate movies! <laughs> oh. And on that bombshell, my friends, thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe.